The smartphone. It is without a doubt the most powerful tool for social interaction ever created. Take a look around. Wherever you go, wherever you look, you will see the smartphone. People aren't just making calls anymore either. Every second of every day, people are accessing text messages, videos, pictures, social media updates, and new powerful software that all have one thing in common, social connection. This is the world we live in today, the world of instant comprehensive communication. It has revolutionized the way we form relationships, the way we come together, and the way we communicate. Did you know that more progress with technology has been made in the last 10 years than in the past 1,000? We now hold that technology in the palm of our hands. Now imagine using this mobile technology to grow a global business infrastructure, to help people all around the world, and to change your own life. Introducing J-Mobile. J-Mobile is a powerful app that gives you unlimited access to custom text, teasers, and cinema quality digital marketing videos that all link back to your store. J-Mobile was created to help you leverage mobile marketing to your advantage by sharing your story in a simple but elegant way. This powerful app allows you to build your business on the go. J-Mobile sends push notifications for almost everything you need to know, keeping you organized and up to date with your business. Link directly to your social media channels with one-touch sign-in and get real-time business updates to keep you on the right track to success. Growing your Jeunesse business and following up with prospects has never been easier with the tools and resources that are one touch away. We are Generation Young. We are Jeunesse. Hello, good evening, my Jeunesse family. Welcome to our first back office training tonight. Wow, I see many of you attend the training tonight. So I perhaps, I hope that every one of you already taken your dinner, sit back, relax, and perhaps you have your favorite drink with you now, ready your notebook, and so that you can jot down all the important points throughout the training. So be, uh, in our training, right, in the end of the training, we do have a Q&A session. So if you have any questions about J Office or about J Mobile, you can just type your, you can uh, ask during the Q&A sessions, or you can type your questions in our Q&A box so that our speaker will answer your question uh, during the training, or they will answer your questions uh, during the Q&A session. So remember, if you have any question about the J Office or about J Mobile, you can type your question in our Q&A box, all right? So without further ado, let me introduce our first speaker. He has been uh, doing sales in various platforms for over 10 years, and he was in a management role in a top e-commerce company. He's a very experienced person uh, in e-commerce. So I believe he's the best person to share with us about a uh, Genesis with J Mobile, harness the power of mobile technology and social media marketing. So let's welcome our Singapore Ruby Director, Jeremy. Hello, hi everyone. TGIF, thank goodness it's Friday. So thank you everyone for logging in today. Thank you, Irene, for the wonderful and very, very energetic uh, introduction. So today I'll be covering uh, J Mobile with you guys. So, for the people who don't really know what J Mobile is, it's basically an app that is actually uh, designed by our office and it is really very, very intuitive. So, from my understanding, um, when I look at um, the people who are in this business, most of us don't really use J Mobile or even share Juness very much. And I think it's really very sad because the company actually invests in a lot of time and effort and uh, we do have uh, software designers who are really looking into the CRM of business and how it is helping us to build this business together. 
And the beauty of it is that with, as you all know, Juness actually have gold standard uh, marketing materials from videos to pictures, beautiful pictures and beautiful videos that we always see, right? And now you are able to actually do this business at the palm of your hand, meaning that you can use it on your mobile phone. And the beauty of it is that most of the things that you want can actually be accessed from the mobile phone, which is really, really very interesting. And it makes your business really mobile and very intuitive. So um, without further ado, um, I'm going to first do a sharing of a share screen to my mobile. So don't mind me if I'm you know, looking down or whatever. <clears throat> so hope you all can see. So the first thing you all want to take a look is um, to go into the app here and search for J Mobile. So over here, as you can see, there is this J Mobile app already. So it is actually uh, available in iPhones and in Android phones. So do download it if you have not. Okay, so this is going to be something massive for 2021 that you're going to explore and you're going to really use it and you will see changes in your productivity. Okay, so going ahead to open it. So this is actually my personal uh, J Mobile app. So you can see a little picture uh, on the left of, uh, of me. And that is where when you click on, sorry. So when you click on the top button here, the arrow, you can actually edit your profile pictures and all this. And uh, you can actually put in some of the details that you want, all right? And then you can do the edit as well, okay? So moving down, you actually see J News. So J News is really just a Jeunesse news, like a newspaper where you can actually see, you know, how they wish us and all this. And then uh, what are the offers and what are the promotions, when it start, when it end. So one of the things you want to take note when you're using the J Mobile app is that um, people like me, right, we are very used to pressing the bottom button here, the arrow, right, where it's a back button. But when you press the back button, right, generically, it will get out of the app. So what you want to do is to actually have this over here, which is to use this back button instead. So when you do the back button like this, it goes back. Okay. So over here, when you click on the picture, you actually go to this particular article. You can also scroll and you can actually see all the events and all this, all the news that um, corporate is trying to communicate with us. So apart from just your typical email, you can actually read your articles here as well. So you can actually click here and you see, see more. So when you click in, you can actually see all the articles that you, that you want to take a look. Okay. And then over here, you can even click filter. So when you click filter, you will actually see language. I can tell you, Jeunesse really pampers us distributors. If you look at the amount of, amount of languages that I'm scrolling, there are more than 30 languages. You know, for, for any company to have translation of over 30 languages, it's not the easiest, it's not the cheapest. And we don't even need to come out a single cent to actually do all this, okay? So on top of that, you can actually categorize all your text and all this, right? Uh, not Sorry, on the news that you want to watch, okay, or, or follow up or catch up. Okay, whether it's Jeunesse Kids, it's packages, or maybe it's products, it's recognition, etc. So you can you can choose what you want to see. Okay, and then after that, you just click apply. Okay, so over here, next I'll go into uh, news alert. So news alert is also the alert news that you want the company or to to send to you, or you know um, what you want to basically see so over here. You can see you can set to general alerts or you know videos and uh, you know recommended uh, actions, new leads, etc. These are the uh, alerts that you want to be received at the initial dashboard of your app, so that you are always up to date. <clears throat> so, like for example, later on I'll be sharing how do you build leads and uh, how do you put leads into this and how you utilize all this. So, for example, if you say, hey, I got a new lead, you know, it will alert you. If you didn't take this lead, for example, then you will not see the alert, okay? And then you apply. So, next, <clears throat> you will see mailbox as well. Mailbox is typically what you would see, like now we are having the run to Ruby, right? So, this is like what you would typically see on your email. It's loading. So, this is what you will see on your email, okay? And... uh. 
you read this like as if it's from the email and you can uh, click and all this to go in as well, okay? So next, what I'll be covering will be on social media. So as you can see here, over in the middle, there's also a uh, certain leads that you can do in an action path. So this I'll cover a bit later, but over here is like a dashboard where you can see at the bottom, here's a dashboard where it gives you a generic overview of all the things that you want to see. Okay, so once you've set up your name list and all this, you can actually uh, set a path for each people, which I'll show you a bit later, all right? So the next will be social media. So you can actually see all the very beautiful pictures that Jeunesse has actually designed for us, you know, aesthetically pleasing. And when people look at it, people may want to say, hey, I want to know more. So you see, you don't have to go and hire a designer for logos, for your flyers or whatever to do your social media blast to your friends or, you know, whether it's by social media or it could be by WhatsApp, you know, all these are all readily available and done for you from videos to pictures. So when you click see more, you can actually go into, into this where you can see um, all the tons of pictures over here. See, all very beautiful. See, if you see the filter on top here, there is 1,200 pictures. So over here, when you click, you can also filter. You can also do by language and you can decide what kind of content you want to build for that particular person or a group or, or for the day. So for example, if you say, hey, you know, um, today I deselect or I want something that's going to do with lifestyle. So I click and I apply. And you see all the pictures over here are all lifestyle uh all of lifestyle um, purpose right so if maybe i say hey maybe um sorry so if i go again and then i click filter and if i deselect and say hey this time around maybe i want motivational codes because many people out there they love motivate motivational codes and this is something that people will look at it more and then the subliminal uh, logos and all this is what is set us apart from other people so you see like, for example, uh, Zen Project 8, you have to strive for progress, not perfection, you know. Set another goal, you know. These are the very nice motivations that's already been done for you. All this is something that you can use, okay. So, over here, I've already selected. So, let me just apply, go back, okay. So, over here, next, you have the help center. You see, when Juness creates uh, an app or a software or whatever, they do really go in depth not only on the pictures and the videos, but you see, even training videos. Look at this help center. Over here, you have 14 training videos that actually covers your dashboard overview, how to set up your profile, how to add leads, etc. Everything you possibly may want to know. See, even how to create a video playlist. Uh, this is basically the J-Mobile Prospector. It's like prospecting, you know? And then uh, how to work with leads, how to personalize, everything is here. Beautiful, isn't it? So next, you also have your typical FAQ, which is your frequently asked questions, right? So all these are the questions that people have asked before. And what do you get out of it? All right. So moving on to the bottom tab. Before I go to the bottom tab, uh, sorry, I'm getting some messages, so don't mind me. Uh, I, I will remove it. Um, okay, so the next will be, I'll go to the third tab first, okay, which is leads. So leads are basically your prospects and all this. So over here, if you see, right, when you click the top button here, the plus button, you basically, it's an add button. So you can add contacts, add new leads, you can add groups. So for groups, right, you can even add, for example, I got a group of uh, potential prospects who are very health conscious you know, who love health products like our Reserve, our Mind, you know, our Revital Blue, etc. And then maybe I got another group that, hey, it's about beauty or maybe someone who wants to do weight loss. So weight loss is a Zen body. You can click on group and you can actually just do, uh, you know, a group and then after that, you can add the leads inside, okay? So over here, if let's say I want to add a contact, so I've already done a sample. So I say I do a test. So I click on this, okay, and then it's done. So see, success. So this particular person now is in my list. So you can add all your friends and all your lists or all the prospects that you find is co-lead, warm lead, etc. Put them in 
and then you are populating your list and this will be your sales funnel. So this is how you're going to take actions on it. So you can be sending mass emails, mass um, message, mass um, uh, uh, videos, etc., to a group or to an individual person. So for example, now if I click into this, this is my email. For example, you can decide whether you want to call, SMS, or email. So if you go below, under the actions, you can see I have a see more. You actually can, for example, like I shared to you, share a video or you send a sign up link of your link. So, you know, when you, let's say, for example, if I click sign up link, right? And I say, hey, I want to send by SMS. You already will see that it is sending to your email. And you can even personalize like, hi, I realize that you are interested to join me, for example. See, you can personalize your, e your message and when you, you can send an SMS to the person. Fantastic, right? And also you can even send by email as well. So when you send by email, you also get the same thing. Okay, you can personalize your message as well. All right, so this is for the share. So you can also start, like for example, an email campaign. So an email campaign is where you have the first video, the second video, the follow-up video, and then um, this has a little bit of an AI touch to it where it actually can share the path that this particular person might be going. It may be leaning towards a business or products, etc., and it actually helps and guides you along the way. All right? At the same time, also here, you can see a schedule reminder. So you can say, I want to send a message to this person or send a particular uh, uh motivational code out to, to anybody, okay? I can set a schedule so that it reminds me that I need to do this particular action on this particular date at this particular time. So you see, it's amazing. It is everything that you need in the business and we are underutilizing it. So this is something that we really need to look at, use it and improve our productivity, okay? So these are the paths. And then also over here, if you see at the bottom, you can choose a path. So you see, this is the AI part of things also you can choose. So when you click in, you can actually decide the path that you want to go. You want to go for the beauty. Uh, you want to go for the instantly ageless. You want to go for, for example, a financial opportunity, etc., etc. So if you go to financial opportunity, you click in, okay? It will say at the bottom here, the action path and what percentage have you accomplished? And then what are the recommended actions? And then what you're going to do? So over here is something um, I won't really go in depth, but it's for you to something to try out. If you're not too sure, at the dashboard I shared earlier, you can actually see uh, some of the videos, okay? But this is generically just sharing with you guys what can you do with this particular video, okay? And then you have the share. So over here, the share, you see you have videos, you have the social media, you can run an email campaign, uh, an email message, a campaign is where it's one, you know, like, you know, step one, step two, step three, step four, kind of thing. And then you have a video playlist, YouTube playlist, and then you can have a basic message as well. So over here, you can choose your pictures or videos or whatever. So you've got tons of videos from Evoke to some of even the new products, you know. See, you have a customer loyalty po uh, program, all the new products, uh, affiliate, Nevo, etc. A lot, okay. And then after, after that, over here, you the next button, which is the stats. So on the stats, you also actually see what you will probably see on the J office, which is something uh, our Diamond Director, Chris Chia, will cover in a later time, later on. So you can see basically your business snapshots, your genealogy and everything all on the mobile phone. So it's fantastic. You don't even need to log in. And they made this so intuitive that you can actually toggle between J Office to J Mobile and then even to share Juness. Okay, so you can also see all the paths that you have taken. Uh, if you can see, you know how many emails have sent and all this. Everything is all recorded in terms of even statistics and even show you at what statistics and at what level these uh, leads are. Okay, so this is something really fantastic. And then after that, you can actually go to. Okay, sorry, yeah. So you can actually see the video statistics and the and the and the emails that this is over here as well. So this actually gives you a very good coverage. How is your, your campaigns doing? And uh, how is the outreach? Are people responding to it or not? So this is something very, very important. And this is something that uh, people pay a lot of money 
to get this into their business. And we are getting it for free, by the way. Next, and the last part is um, more. So over on more, you will see we can actually get into Share Juness and J Office as well, or even J Cloud if you, if you need to download certain documents. Okay, and then you can even see our Juness live events as well. So these are things that you probably already know or what Chris, uh, our diamond director, will share with you. But what I want to cover here is this, getting started. This is something that you can even use to showcase to your prospects when you're doing ABC with them. Okay, when you come in here, you basically can even show them how our office is like and who are our founders and everything. They even have a compensation plan. So if you see products here, um, it's only a one video of uh, YES system at the moment, but you can go to share to Nest, there are probably more. And then you can see financial rewards as well. So you, you, know, you want to learn about the compensation plan for yourself or even to show to your prospects, it's all here. You want to show the company's profile, who are the founders, etc. They are all here, or even a quick view of the office in uh, USA. Yeah, it's here as well. And then, you know, you have your also your getting started tools and all this, and then you know, know your back office training and all this. They are all at the palm of your hand. So this really, to me, is one of the most powerful marketing CRM tool that we have, and. We are underutilizing it. So I really urge you guys to play around with it and to get your hands on this, download it, and use it. So with this, I really end my presentation. I hope this has been really, really fruitful and really, uh, you know, um, full of information that you need and full of excitement for you as well. Okay, so I'm going to hand over the mic back over to Irene. Irene, please. Uh, thank you, Jeremy. Thank you for the sharing. Well, very informative. Very important. I believe every one of you to learn a lot about Jay Mobile, right? If yes, type what yes in our chat box. Let me see whether you really understand. Learn a lot. Yeah, wow. See, everyone learned a lot about Jay Mobile today. So again, if you have any questions about Jay Mobile and Jay Office, please type your question in our QA box. So later on, our speaker will answer your questions, okay? Again, uh, you have any questions about Jail Mobile and Jail Office, please type your question in our Q&A box. Later on, we will answer your questions. So next, I would like to introduce our next speaker. Actually, she is my uh, schoolmate. Because of, uh, because of her, I know about JS platform. So uh, I know she is a dedicated person. She's dedicated on what she's doing. And she's a, a hands-on person. Uh, and in our team, she's a... She's a back office encyclopedia. So every time we have an encounter a problem about the back office, she's the one who teach us and guide us. So she's the best person to share with us how we use, how to use a back office tool effectively. So let's welcome our Diamond Director, Christian. Hello, hello. Thank you, Irene, for the wonderful introduction. Thank you very much. How are you, everyone, online tonight? If yeah, doing good. Can I? Can you type 888? Wow, the Chinese favorite number. 888. Come on. Karen Kong. Alice Tan. Sharon. Okay, Nancy Tang. Sunny. Okay. Good, good, good. Fat, fat, fat. Everyone, okay? So tonight, welcome our business partner from Malaysia and Singapore to join our first 2021 uh, back office training. Of course, I would like to congratulations for all the new newly joined business partner because this will be a great opportunity for you to explore what is that, uh, how, what, what we say is a, a business that we didn't just a handphone, okay? So let me kickstart what are they inside the back office that everyone of you can uh, to understand and explore more, all right? So just want to be remind everyone, if you have a questions, remember there's a Q&A icon there, you can type your question there. Let's say you want to type, want to ask in Chinese, you can type also in Chinese and I will reply in English, okay? So that every, everyone is covered, all right? If you have question, maybe also will be answered throughout my uh, presentation. If it's not, then later on, I will add on how to, uh, uh, answer your all your question okay how first how to know your j office let's let me uh share the screen first okay good so just now jeremy had mentioned you can have a shortcut from your j mobile go to your j office 
or you can log to your J office from a website. You just type www.jnsglobal.com, okay? Then next step you need to do is once you enroll, first you need to go to click to my profile to check if all your information is correct, okay? So you can type in joneglobal.com or joneglobal.com. Even though when you type joneglobal.com, once the IP address detected you are in Malaysia, they will auto convert to the uh, Malaysia, the, the, browser, the website browser, okay? Good. So on top here, when you log in already, key in your login ID, password, there's a setting icon that click on it, all right? Then you will see, all right, my account, wallet, order, mailbox. These are the few drop down items, all right? Then you can click on your my account, okay? Then you will see either, either it will show my account or my profile because US, they, are, they will show my account. For Malaysia, it's called my profile, all right? So first step is you need to verify the information inside your my profile. For example, your email address, your phone number, okay? These are the all important things, your shipping address and so on, or your and your phone number. If you have changes in your phone number or your addresses, you can always update in your My Profile. Just remember, once you click submit any changes, remember to click submit at the bottom of the page. Okay, good. So second thing, besides checking the your personal information, the second thing that you can do in this My Profile is about log placement. Everybody know in this business, we built two international team, one on the left and one on the right. So before you enroll any person to kickstart the business, you should this do this log placement in advance, okay? So where to find the log placement? Same, is in your My Profile. Just scroll a little bit down. You can see the box there. We box it up, all right? So from there, you can click, all right? You can click uh, left or right or automatic, okay? So in your My Profile, you can log left, right or automatic. Once you set it, you can. You must remember, click submit changes. Okay, as a double check after you submit changes, you can go back to your My Profile and see whether it's already changed. Remember, this one you need to do before you enroll anyone into the business. Okay, so once you enroll the person, how to verify? How can I know whether I have successfully enrolled it and is still actually in the correct position? So you can go to your just now the uh, My Business, click sponsorship and you can have a look all your enrollee, whether they are on the right or on the left. Okay, just one another tips. Huh? Let's say, let's say I, uh, I forgot to lock the placement and I already enrolled a person. What should I do? Can I change? The answer is yes, between three working days. What you need to do is just submit a form to the customer service and tell them you want to change the placement. Okay, if you are good so far, can you put type one here? I want to see one. If you are good so far, type one. <laughs> I want to make sure you are clearly received the information. Good, 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 good. Okay. In this process, every time you just need to double check. Don't wait until you enroll three to four days later, only you check. After you enroll, immediately check so that any things that you want to change, you can do it immediately, all right? Okay, now how about automatic? I saw this automatic button there, okay. So the automatic button is very simple. If you didn't change anything, automatic meaning the first you enroll will pop the same common link with your sponsor. For example, if your sponsor and you, the common link is on the right side. If your lock placement is automatic, therefore the first person that you enroll will be on your right side and the second person that you enroll will be on your left side all right so it will it will run like that as automatically however we advise you to not set as automatic because uh, uh as the system will not know your business plan who you want to put on the left or on the right okay good okay next a part of checking your My Profile and Log Placement, you can see when you go to the main page, you can see this on top banner, another shortcut for you all. You can see Wallet, My Business Shop, Smart Delivery Events and Tools. Okay, now let's have a look at our My Business. Okay, what is there in under the column of my business, there's a distributor report, genealogy, general legacy, enroller tree, cycle, commission, 
all this okay sponsorship binary information donation statement bonus credit taken and bonus credit taken transactions okay so i will not go one by one but just highlight a few that important okay so first what you see on your dashboard when you open up on the left it should be appear your name all right and your current rank okay the the icon active meanings you are on smart delivery on 60 point every month then you are active the meaning of qualify is have you become uh, 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 you have uh, any enroll anyone if you have enrolled anyone then you are qualified okay this is how is your business snapshot look like okay secondly if you are a, a director rank and above you may open to able to see the sales performance by your team wow you see everything is all prepared you are the ceo of your company the company have draw the graph for you daily sales volume okay okay next is you will able another to see the important information is the smart delivery i will go details on this because many people confuse about when is on my smart delivery should i do normal smart delivery or prepaid smart delivery okay, okay. let me make it bigger All right last smart delivery order next smart delivery paid and prepaid order okay how to see the, the difference okay last smart delivery order meaning the last uh, date that you your smart delivery order is running or the, the date that it due date last time last month all right then the next smart delivery date they're giving you a reminder when should you do your next smart delivery date meanwhile prepaid order meaning when you do in advance the system will show you when is the last date of your smart delivery order will run all right so when you when you see the dates uh, okay as you see the first number is re uh, represent the month april 9 2020 may 9 2020 and august 9 2020 okay so next i will explain once you know how to see your smart delivery order, smart delivery date, then you need to know which smart delivery order you should option you should go to. Okay, so this is the first scenario. Let's say when you open your back office, you realize, hey, eh, I like already missed my. Can you repeat this part? Which part, Ranjit? I saw Singapore. Uh, you mean the the three three smart delivery? Maybe crunch it, you can, yeah. I, I try to repeat again. Okay, last smart delivery date is when is the last date that uh, your order process for your, how to track our smart delivery. It's on the business snapshot. Okay, it's on your page. You see the, the, the one that I box up. Okay, this is, will should appear in your, business snapshot at this column above your commissional volume all right you should able to see it and then there's three three uh rem three uh different reminder or three different details in the smart delivery column your last smart delivery order meaning the last date or the last month when is the date of running of the smart delivery when when is your next smart delivery due date and if you are having any prepaid order that is running automatically okay then now i will go in details right on the smart delivery so when you see like this two two uh indication okay two indication first when you see your point already zero right so when you see point already zero meaning you should do normal smart delivery okay in our new system there's no longer seven days reminder okay so you need to be alert on your this normal smart delivery how how you want to place the order when you see zero yes you should do normal smart delivery and if you pass uh, your if you are still in the seven days of your grace period for example okay this one is the due date is january 10 let's say today is 15 january okay let's say today is 15 january you are still in the seven days grace period and your 60 point will still uh will be zero 
but your point below that will not flush. Remember, your point is not flush doesn't mean you fulfill your smart delivery. You must always remember in your current CV, every time must show you fulfill 60 points. That is the important indication to tell you you are qualified on the current CV. So if within seven days, let's say this one is January 10, if on the 17 Malaysia time, you didn't do your smart delivery on the 18 Malaysia time, your point will flush already. So you cannot argue with the company, hey, my point is what was not flush, why suddenly flush, something like that. So always the indication is the 60 point. That's why I box up. You must always know how to in, uh, find the information, okay? Another indication is you need to know is even though there's a tick icon there, last tick icon, last smart delivery order, it just uh, play a role as telling you when is your last Monday smart delivery. It doesn't tell you you actually do your smart delivery order. The correct and uh, uh, how to say precise indication is your current CV must show 60 point. I hope I uh, explain it clearly for all the, the new member, especially if you're still uncertain, you can always check that. Therefore, I always advise all my dear friend and business partner do at once prepare smart delivery. Okay. Okay. Next. Okay. Next, prepaid smart delivery. So the second scenario is like this. For example, your, you already fulfill your current month uh, smart delivery. You already have 60 points in your account. All right. Then you suddenly say, hey, I want to purchase another box of reserve. All right. So what do you do is you place it order as a prepaid smart delivery at once for your account. All right. You do not buy it under normal smart delivery. Therefore, do not do the mistake. If you are uncertain, I always encourage the new distributor, new business partner, before you place any order, please reconfirm with your sponsor or your leader. All right. So when your smart delivery date is not yet due, when you want to purchase 60 points, always click the option prepaid smart delivery. Okay. I hope I mentioned it clearly. So just now, this is another example. If you're already on a running prepaid smart delivery, for example, you buy the package, let's say now the Juness University package, it complements with three months in advance. So you will see in your system, you already have a prepaid, right? But let's say, oh, next month, the company also launched another prepaid smart delivery promotion. Uh, when I buy, will it uh, clash with my current uh, prepaid? The answer is no, the company is very generous. It will continue. Let's say you already have three months in advance and you purchase another six months, it will become total nine months, all right? So the company is very generous. The more you spend and you can uh, uh, accommodate under the smart delivery category, okay? Good. All right. So how to place the order on top, you can see, on the top menu there, there's this smart delivery uh, button. You click on it, all right? And then you can you will see there's two options, monthly smart delivery and prepaid smart delivery, okay? So it depends on your current month, which one you want to do the, all right? So let's say if you are in the monthly smart delivery, what do you need to do is, uh, whatever item that you have add in, uh, you can change it every month. Okay, you can change it every month. You just add it in. If you this last month you, you buy reserve, it will show that. Let's say this month you want to buy serum, you just remove the item and add a new one. And then just pro follow the step accordingly. All right, follow the step accordingly. All right, so there's another one uh, I, uh, item in the smart delivery I would like to highlight is there's item, let's say you buy one box of Evoke. All right, it gives you a better discount. And there's another package called Youth Enhancement Package, which have 200 CV. I'm talking about, uh, okay, under the prepaid smart delivery, you will see this additional option for you. So when you see this, eight, it carry 200 points. Will I carry forward the, 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 the point? For the this package in particular, Youth Enhancement Packages, it only reflect for one month. Okay, remember it's only reflect for one month because the company have given you 
uh, discounted product, more product. Okay, so this is just to reward back the 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 the, the customer or the business partner. Okay, just remind uh, all of you. Okay, all right. So when you have selected the items that you want, then you just click purchase. Okay, all right. So for for any, I go back. Huh? So for prepaid smart delivery, any combinations of uh, sixty point for one month or one hundred twenty point for two months. Or and so on. As long as every 60 point that you place the order in advance, it will accumulate, become the number, it will reflect as number of months that you purchase. What I love about this feature is the company very generous. As, as, a, as a worldwide promotion, if you purchase six months in advance, you will get additional serum, okay? And you can save your shipping costs. Instead of buying it every month and you have to pay the monthly uh, delivery fees now you can purchase in uh, in advance you get free gift and you can save your uh delivery fees and most important you will never miss your uh the, the date okay for the current cv okay then after you select the product that you want to purchase you just reconfirm your shipping information okay for is for instance the, the shipping information that you key in earlier and now you want to ship to your friend the shipping information is Changeable, so you can change to anyone that is receiving the product. Okay, after you key in the information, you just uh, select whether you want to shipping or office pickup. Okay, so this is for smart delivery. So I want to ex explain about shop. Whenever you buy anything from shop, it will not count under smart delivery. It's a two different thing. So I want to highlight is the, the, the benefit of doing smart delivery is you get better discount product and you maintain your, your, your account. At the same time, if, if you are doing six months, uh, when you enroll up to your anniversary date, you did six months uh, smart delivery in your own account, the renewal fee for the next month is auto waived. So there's another benefit and another reason for you why you should go into the uh, smart delivery. So under shop is a good feature where we can purchase the product all around the world. So let's say today we have Nara, right? Nara, we have Malaysia Nara, we have Singapore Nara, we have Hong Kong Nara, right? So if you want to purchase product out of your registered country, you just go to shop. Then you can click to this shop local and it will appear all the country that you want to, to know. Sometime your friend might ask you, hey, I saw this reserve is good. And I want to ask if UK if available or not and how much is it? So what you need to do is you can self go and explore. You just click USA or Korea, just go there and see the currency and just click around and, and place the order and see how much is the shipping fee. So it's very, very, very convenient, okay? Now I want to highlight two features under this shop. We have event packages and market special. Well, event packages is where we have like lead events, Jeunesse University, you can find the packages under event packages. Well, like market specials, maybe sometime we have the, like, like last, last month, we have this Christmas special, like Singapore market and Malaysia market, we have Christmas special. How about maybe you have friends in Australia, you want to check out eh, whether in their, comp in their country, do, do they have any market special? So there's these places where you can find what are the current promotion in the country, all right? Great. So next, either you place smart delivery order or shop order, or you want to view your downline order, you always can come to this order feature. All right. So you can go under this uh, uh, my, my profile, all right, just on the setting icon, you click on it and you can see the third column is the orders. All right. So in the orders, right, you can see your own current order and you can see the next page for the looking for the next, next, next order. And you can see there's few column, paid item, the invoice, spending status, and the tracking number. Just to rest assured all the business partner, sometimes when we click uh, uh, some order, you place place order, then sometimes the system down or you, you, you didn't complete your credit card payment. The, the order will still appear in your order recording. That is just a history for us to track all the transaction. It doesn't mean that you need to pay and there's no way for you to, to, to complete the payment because all our transaction is live in the back office. So once you, you 
complete it, that is considered, if it is marked paid, that is considered complete. If in the halfway you do the transaction, uh, maybe the bank system down or something, then you will still, in your back office, you still can see the order number, you still can see what you're ordering, but the status is not paid. It's okay, you just, just leave it there, it doesn't matter, it won't give you any harm, okay? Not to worry, okay? Good. So next is what is the benefit to see the, the, the back office order if you can check your uh, downline order as well. As you can see the order type, there's back office, there's smart delivery and the back office PB. You see, I love this feature very much. Why? Because I can see what, what are the ordering order that my, my, my team is placing. And sometimes I can check whether they got placed wrongly order or not. Because if you see back office PB, meaning they are, they are placing prepaid smart delivery. If they are placing at the shop or normal smart delivery, it will appear at the back office. For example, your, your business partner say, hey, leader, I already placed my prepaid smart delivery. But when you check in your order, your downline order, you see it is considered as back office. So you might want to recheck with your business partner whether they actually really put the correct uh, smart delivery order type or not. So meanwhile, for your own order, you can check the invoice. You can always check the invoice, uh, whether it's shipped to where and when you purchase the product. You can always see and view back in your system, okay? And thirdly is you can check the tracking. Sometimes maybe it's your business partner in Sabah, Johor, whatever, they place the order normally, between uh, KL Clang Valley area within our, our, our this area is three to four working days. Maybe to Sabah is five working days. So you always can. No need, first thing is I will encourage business partner to explore it first. What you need to do is just click the tracking, the lorry icon there. Go and find the tracking, tracking number and go to CityLink. Go to CityLink. Uh, uh, sometimes it will appear to you that the status or uh, is uh, still at the warehouse or something something or if there's if there's no uh, description there you can always copy and paste the, the tracking number and go to city link there to check the status i feel that is very very convenient very convenient because this is our business of course we can call with customer service to to track for us but it will take time because there's so much call they've been taking care. Of. But all with all this assistant tracking number, we actually can handle it, and it's much more faster. We can just screenshot and show to our customer. It's already in the warehouse. It's delivering something, something. So it also gives them the confidence. Wow, our company very have a systematic to to trace and to to handle the the order. So so, so the second thing is you can download your current order list if you want to do some inter inventory checking or you're doing for your accounting purposes and there's, there's uh, your download your order and there's an organization chart is for you to check your enrollee tree order. And this last icon is called search. You can search from when to when the order number. So all the tools is there. So you can always check back your order and under the order type, you need to uh, click it to zero so that you can see the, all, the, all the, the, the order from your team. Okay, because it's auto set in the back offices, you can see your four latest uh, downline order. So at the order type, you just clear, make it to zero, then you can see all, all the business partner order. Am I going too fast? Everybody still okay? If you're okay, type okay for me. Can or not? Type okay if you're still okay. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Wow, okay, okay. King say okay, Karen say okay, Linda say okay, good, 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 good. Very, very excellent, very excellent. Great. So uh, you can see my order and Rolly order and for Sapphire and above, you can see downline order. So sometimes don't worry, eh, how come your report and my report is different? Of course, because we're in a different rank. It's not it's not wrong, it's not something wrong with the with the back office, huh? Okay. Wow. Okay, next about e-wallet e-wallet okay good e-wallet about money how to set up your e-wallet is important all right for this feature there's two you need to take note first when you enroll when you sign up someone if you immediately put in their bank account details whenever they get a commission it will auto pay up all right so if when you when you enroll someone they didn't put what is the different enrollee order and downline order okay Enrollee order is the person that you uh, 
from your tree means uh, is is from your your direct sponsor and beyond okay and okay can so and then downline order is you can see beyond and royalty is the your level one your level one and then your downline order is beyond your level two and level three okay 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 i thank you i answer your question the split over you weren't able to see 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 the order okay thank you so i'm talking about wallet all right so if you miss out uh putting in the bank account so in the e-wallet you can do it okay and why is it so important to this e-wallet setup is it's important not only updating your bank account details but it's important to upload your ic as well to get paid because as a security purposes the company will let to confirm the person that they pay out is same as the person that registered for the account okay so when you first log in remember all the new distributor or all the leaders online whenever you log into your account the first time in your e-wallet the system will require you to type the username and the username that you created cannot be the same with the one you log into your j office this is the first criteria and the second thing that you want to remember is once you click the create login there will be a temporary password automatically sent to the registered email account. Therefore, it's important whenever you and, uh, log into a J office, the first thing you want to verify is all your personal account, especially email address. Cool. So once you get that, the temporary password, then you just need to follow the step to reset the new password for your e-wallet. Okay. So the two important rules is, uh, I mean, important feature is first upload your government ID, View your account history and also the fund request. I will talk about this three area. So it's important for you to upload the bank, uh, your ID first for company to make sure the bank account and the ID is the same. Okay. And secondly, uh, if we are if you are participating in any cash promotion, for example, now run for Ruby. All right. So you must upload your IC in order for you to qualify to get paid. And thirdly. If you upload your government ID, only you can use the your e-wallet money for your uh to use back to place order. I mean, let's say your, your your wallet have money, then when you pay for your prepaid order or you buy anything, you want to use your e-wallet money. If you did upload your IC, then you can use the e-wallet money to pay for your purchase. If you do not, then you can't pay with your e-wallet money. And there will be a, a small reminder up there mentioned, uh, please upload your government ID, for instance. Okay. So when you when you upload the, 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 the IC, they will tell you there's two options. One is passport, one is alien ID. So ours for Malaysian market is called alien ID, all right? So I'm, I'm not very sure for the Singapore, right? So, but bear in mind, it's, it's, it's just a, a, a name, alien ID, or alien ID, all right? Then under the ID, identification number, you just submit your IC number without the hash uh, symbol, and then you click submit, all right? And then it about it takes about two to three days for the for the HQ to verify and make sure you upload a color, full color IC. And in case of your whatever that you upload is not clear and so on, the company will send a friendly reminder to your email to request you to upload again. It's all very systematic. Okay, good. So next is uh set up your uh, bank account. Okay, set up your bank account. It's quite simple. So under the, the, the EFT setting, EFT setting, you just uh, click there, Malaysia, then the name is automatically, you can't feel because it's synced with the name that you register. And then you just type in your account number and also the bank number and the account type. I don't think we have account type for the Malaysia number. Yes, Shirley Wong only upload the front page of the IC. Remember, it's full color, okay? Once you submit your bank account, uh, the bank name, in Malaysia, it's called bank name. You have a few a few bank. And we have one this um, option under Boom CMB. Under CMB, there's two categories, CMB, Bubi Putra, and CMB, CMB uh, Southern Bank something. Both also is applicable for CMB Bank, okay? Then you click Submit. After you click Submit, uh, it will appear again, your details, and you just reconfirm the details and you click Submit, okay? Cool. Great. Next slide, come. 
Mm. Okay, so let's say, let's say uh, 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 you want to change the bank account, right? Let's say you maybe when, when the first time you key in, there's something wrong, you didn't receive your, 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 your commissions, then you re after you check with company, you realize there's error in your in your in your the number that you key in or whatever, there's mistake. What you, you, you can do is you I click under tools, distributor tools, there's this um bank account update form. There's a lot of form under the distributor tools, just like as I mentioned, the, the form to change the placement. All right, cancellation form or whatever, all, all is there. So once of the bank account update form, you can uh, obtain from there. And always you need to attach with your IC whenever you email to the company to do any changes for your back, back office, all right? Now, next one is you can click under view your account history. You can see what is your available balance. Okay, available balance and when you actually transfer some money out, then you will see the, the center column electronic fund in pending transaction. That is the money that is uh, uh, waiting to transfer out. Okay. So our so for the fund, that, that is to show how much money you have. And this one is how to withdraw the money. Okay, next step, I teach you how to withdraw the money. Under the fund request, okay, you click fund request, you click the amount that you want, and then you click uh, the method is EFT, means electronic fund transfer, okay? Any fund transfer made by 10 p.m. Easter time every Wednesday, it will pay up on the following Monday. If you if you do it on the Thursday of the Easter time, then it will pay on the, the next Monday, the next, next Monday, okay? I hope I, I, I explained it clear, okay? Once you did it, then you will know what we're trying to say. So just experience whatever we have teach today, you can just experience it, okay? So it's the same thing, it's the same thing. Then you can see, it will appear there. Once you click submit, you can see the status, whether it's, it's approved, whether it's completed, something like that. If it's not completed, maybe because you didn't upload your IC, something like that, okay? Cool. So payment methods, okay? Yeah how to enroll okay so it's important to know how to enroll is you can click on the website join our family okay why why is like that huh? okay then i skip about the how to enroll first commission so uh just for all for information the commission is paid by every week to your wallet based on the specific paid date right in our commission column you can see right so there's two, uh, every new enrollee, the paid date is three weeks after. Why? Because every new person that you sign up as, as their customer, they're protected. They have 30 days to refund policy. Therefore, for the new sign up commission, it will pay three weeks after you earn the commission. However, for the commission like cycle income, leadership matching bonus is paid up every week. Okay, it's pay out every week. So in the commission report, you can see there's few types, let's say cycle income, level one match bonus, level two, level three, and level four. So you can, you can see everything in one report or you can go in specific also can. So at the main page, you can see it's the date earned. Meanwhile, at the side top there, okay, you can, as I said, you can specific see. If you click level one, you can short filter for you. Okay, you can see who are the who are your team is earning and also contribute to you for the level one matching bonus. And you also can click the search button or the download button as well. Okay, everything you can play around and click and sort it as well. Okay, next. You can also can download it if you want to check one by one. Okay, next. Okay, see the arrow there, the paid date. So your earn date, let's say, whatever you earn this week, it will pay up on the uh, February 24. Okay, so you can see the difference, your earn date and your paid date. Okay, good. Then all your record for your, the day one you earn in Jeunesse, it will, all the record will be stored inside your back office. It will not disappear. Okay, cool. Okay, finally, finally, we are very fast uh, already ending the, the, the training. Are you still okay? If you're still okay, give me 100. I want to see 100. Come on, 100. <laughs> 
I hope you like my presentation because I, I wish to go in detail because these are all the frequent asked questions or that you all might encounter, okay? So I hope you love the presentations that I, I, I shared with you, all right? So uh, and another one is distributor report is where we can find all the report or all the cash promotion report or do buy report, okay? Or our founders pool report. Okay, there's one thing for the founder pool report that you need to check is whether your team is generate enough uh, five people in smartly for you to entitle the founder pool. Okay, sorry, my computer run a bit faster. Okay, so you need to always check whether you have five people doing smart delivery. Then only you entitle the founder pool. So don't say you don't know or I miss it. So this, this is the tracking for you to see whether you are qualified, whether you have five people on smart delivery, okay? Five people on smart delivery or you enroll new uh, business partner also consider, okay? Also consider, okay. Next is how to check if you're enjoying extra level one, level two matching bonus. As some of you is aware, we have this uh, additional uh, matching bonus additional 25% up to 30%. So how to check it? You don't want to miss the additional 10% or 20% or 5 to 10%. So you can see how many people in your team are doing the smart delivery. If you have five people doing smart delivery, the level one matching bonus from 20%, you will get additional five become 25%. You have 10 people doing the smart delivery, your level one matching bonus will be from 20 to 30%. So this level one matching bonus is applicable from business partner from Jade and above. So if you're a Jade uh, and above, this is play an important role for you. Okay, it play an important role for you because it affect your income. Okay, cool. Last one, in our Jade office, we can also explore all the events calendar. We need to know how to find where are the upcoming, upcoming events. So, all right, so under tools, okay, so there's a, uh, hmm, getting started, okay, getting started, and then we have this CRM, distributor information, distributor tools, download files, upload files, everything is there, okay, just go around to explore. So, Getting started, this is some just now what uh, Jeremy have, has explained in the J office is available, same as the website as well. So these are the areas that you can explore. I encourage everyone to explore your back office or your, your J mobile because the handphone won't bite you. You just move your hand, your, your finger on it. Okay, cool. So under tools, we have this. Uh, okay, I will not repeat this. Okay, maybe it's my mouse up and down. All right. So if you still want to uh, uh, share, maybe your, your, your business partner is asking you how to do this, how to do that. You don't need to create your own video. You can just leverage on the tools under the back office. There's all this video, how to shop, how to do web wallet setup and so on. Maybe you will have a little bit version of differences between US and Malaysia, but I mean how it's more or less is the same, more or less is the same, okay? Cool. All right, share Jeunesse. Okay, you can access to share Jeunesse. I, I love this share Jeunesse feature because you can download a lot of high res file because sometimes we do events, we need to print some mock board, we do a lot of things. Then uh, even though when we do create flyers, we can find a lot of uh, 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 big file quality, high res file that, that available in share Jeunesse, even, even though video as well. So all the video just like you see at the beginning, is also available in this share genes. Okay, last but not least, let's see what we have. <laughs> Ta -da. Okay, so sometimes your friends will ask me, hey, where can I find a PowerPoint, uh, videos, halal certificate, especially from Malaysia, or how can I get three languages, the luminous in Bahasa, luminous in English, luminous in Chinese, all is under this tools button, distributed information, important information. Not only in Malaysia, you can assess the whole country, the whole, whole world information you can go under Africa, Asia, Greater China, just go by the category and you can just scroll down. Everything is there. So 
For me, I always love to go and look for information. When my business partner asks me for information, I will go in and search. After search, I will, I will guide them, go there to search. Okay, this business is all about duplication, Karina. Whatever that we know, we just need to guide them and not feeding them the information, but we guide them where to look for the information. Okay, especially for Malaysian market, we have three languages of flyers, Bahasa, English, Chinese, all, all is under the, you click Asia and you can able to find uh, Malaysia. Then there's all the, the certificate and flyers. So just now, Jeremy also have highlighted the live chat and, and the support. Of course, um, we are a US, US company, right? So if, if you want, if you have something urgent, all right, morning time, Malaysia time, we can access to our customer service. But let's say in the middle, middle of the night, when you have some urgent matters, you can always log into the live chat online because why we are just, we are 13 hours different. So, so when night time, the, you, you can always seek the US team for uh, a support or live chat for any inquiries, okay? So you see as Malaysia, we're so, so good. Morning time, we can ask our own locals, customer support team uh, to support and the middle or early in the morning, then you can ask from the US team. See, so wonderful, okay? Uh, okay, so at the end, there's this uh, support as well. You can submit a help desk ticket, okay? So this is very technical, la, like you submit a report, then you can see your status and, 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 and whatsoever, okay? All right, so this is quite quite advanced, uh, which, which I don't really use it. Okay, cool. So this is like about how you just like writing an email, but it's in a, in a ticket format. You write out the details, what a category, what are details that you are, you are facing and something like that. And, and I heard one of our business partner always get responsive reply from the US as well. Okay, so I think that's the end of my presentation. And I mean, and it's more on like a sharing, a sharing uh, on how to how to work around on your back office. Of course, there's still some feature that not cover. Let's say how to create a bonus credit token or how to create a sign up token. This one, I think I will not uh, go in details, but you can always refer to your leader because your leader will know how to assist you further. Okay, that's all for now. Thank you, everyone. Hope you like it. Then I pass it over to Irene. Wow, thank you, Chris. Thank you for the sharing, wonderful sharing. I believe our business partner learned a lot about our back office, right? If yes, give me yes, time yes, our chat box, let me know. Yeah, great, right? So now is our uh, uh, Q&A sessions. Please grab the last chance. Uh, if you have any questions about Jay Office or Jay Mobile, please grab this last chance to ask questions so uh, Chris or Jeremy can answer the questions. Okay. Okay. Great. Great. Chris, great. No, no, no questions from our business partner. <laughs> wow. So I believe that everyone is understand and ready to be used our Jay Mobile and also Jay Office tools, right? So actually, we are the CEO in our business. So we hope that uh, we can put into an actions. Uh, to, to what I will learn today in our business, okay? So that's, I think that's all for tonight. So uh, once again, thank you, Chris, and thank you, Jeremy, to give up so wonderful sharing to all our business partners. And also thank you for all of us, uh, every one of you attend this training tonight. So take care, stay safe, and good night. <laughs>